Well, scary situation for passengers on a flight taking off from John Glenn International Airport today. It's after their pilot was forced to make an emergency landing minutes after takeoff. NBC 4's Ted Hart is live at the airport tonight with more on what exactly happened here. Ted? Yeah, American Airlines Flight 2380 was bound for Dallas-Fort Worth when it took off from Port Columbus at 6.30 this morning. A spokeswoman for the airport says, though, that the plane hit a flock of geese shortly after takeoff and immediately returned to make a precautionary landing. The airline says it could not confirm the type of birds involved, but said that maintenance crews were assessing the damage. The aircraft was able to land safely and return to the gate, and passengers were all booked onto other flights. Now, bird strikes are actually quite common. About 14,000 are reported to the FAA each year, but the vast majority of those are non-events. What can make it significant, though, is the size of the bird involved and the part of the aircraft that's hit. And in this case, it, whatever it was, it was enough to cause the pilots to turn around. As pilots and when we're teaching pilots, we, uh, we teach that minimizing the risk is absolutely the, the very foremost thing we need to be concerned about. Um, so whenever something unusual does happen, it's better to be on the ground dealing with that problem than in the air. You have a lot more options on the ground. And Flight 2380 had uh, 161 passengers and a crew of six on board. No one was injured. The FAA says that it will open an investigation into the incident. Local for you and live at the airport, Ted Hart, NBC4.